Hello everyone and welcome back again to On How Channel. My name is Anas, the market for you. So if you have any questions or need requests, make sure to drop them below in a comment or check out my Instagram right here below me. I don't reply to each comment and if you are wondering why is that because simply I'm working for you. And actually this video was requested by one of my subscribers in a comment. I did make a video on how to dropship from Alibaba to Shopify and he did ask me well how the fulfillments of order works. No worries, in this video I will show you how to fulfill orders on Alibaba dropshipping for Shopify. And just like him, if you have any questions or any requests, make sure to drop them below. I will make a video for you or for free. Just drop me a like and a good comment and I will really appreciate it. And I'll be happy for the rest of the day. So it's completely free as well. Anyway, in this video, I will show you as I said, how to fulfill orders on Alibaba for Shopify dropshipping. And if you are wondering why you should use Alibaba instead of Aliexpress, I did mention in my previous video, which is the dropshipping from Alibaba to Shopify, is because the pricing. The pricing on Alibaba for the products are much, much cheaper. And the products for dropshipping are not actually the products on Alibaba.com. Because Alibaba.com is mostly for wholesalers. Uh, people that buy more than 100 units for each product. Mostly Amazon sellers and so on. But for dropshipping center, and yes, dropshipping center, they do have as well dropshipping center, just like an Aliexpress. And by the way, they are the same company. So this makes sense. The product, as I said, on Alibaba Dropshipping Center are for dropshippers. And you can buy them by unit, by a single unit, not just like the wholesale, as I said. And the pricing for those products are much, much cheaper than Aliexpress. So the benefits of using Alibaba instead of Aliexpress is the bigger margin. The margin on those products will be much, much higher. And they do offer as well fast shipping because obviously uh, that's the most important part of dropshipping and they know that that's why they separated the shipping of alibaba.com which is the wholesale and the dropshipping center which is for dropshippers and without any more talking let's just jump to it and show you how to fulfill orders on alibaba dropshipping and i will do that actually step by step not just showing you a section when you're gonna find the orders no i will actually add a product from alibaba to my shopify store then i will buy the product just like any customer from my Shopify store, then I will go to Alibaba dropshipping center and do the fulfillment for it. So this is a step by step and you will not miss out on anything. So let's just jump to it. And by the way, if you did not sync your Shopify store with Alibaba, make sure to check out my channel or just scroll down the description below and you will see the video on how to use Alibaba for dropshipping and connect your Shopify store to the Alibaba dropshipping center. After you do so, head over to apps right here Simply click on it and you will see all the installed apps on your Shopify store and you should see Alibaba dropshipping right here. Simply click on it and it will send you to Alibaba dropshipping center. As you can see, it's called dropshipping.alibaba.com. Not that many people know about, so they did launch their uh, dropshipping center as well. So let's just close this right now. Let's just find the product and we will add it to our Shopify store then we will do the fulfillment then we will buy it actually when we buy it from our shopify store and we will get back to drop shipping center in here and we will do the fulfillment for it and by the way in my video on how to drop ship from alibaba i did show a hidden place on alibaba where you can find the trending products for drop shipping so make sure to check out that video as well and let's just click on hot selling products with a competitive price and let's just go for a product from them and let's just go for it to add it to our Shopify store. What's up with all these messages? Let's just close all of this. So let's just go for a product from here. Let's just scroll down this one, for example. This is uh, so this is a pillow for dogs. So let's just go for this product. So I had to redo this to access it from Safari browser because I didn't notice I'm not signing into an account on Alibaba. And I have to sign into my Gmail and because I did sign up from my Gmail. So I just accessed it from Safari. Now it's good to go. And let's just scroll down and find the product. Here it is. And let's just click on add to import list. And I don't know what's the case here. It keeps telling me you can't import this product. Try another product. Let's just go for another one. Anyway, let's just go for this one, which is a speaker or a humidifier. Let's just click on add to import. Uh, import completed. Let's just go to import list from here. Click on push to store. And it will take a couple of seconds. And here it is. It says push succeeded. So we did add this product to our Shopify store. 
and let's just get back to our Shopify and check if the product exists or not and here it is this is the product that we did add so let's just click on it and buy the product from our Shopify store and we will get back to the Alibaba dropshipping center and we will do the fulfillment for it so let's just click on buy it now and give me a couple of seconds to fill out all these informations uh, will be actually a second for you for me it will be a couple of seconds and your order has been processed right now and it should be working and we will buy the products and here is the thank you uh, test which is just a test order they type in test in the name and your order is confirmed right here so right now we will do the fulfillment on this particular order so let's just get back to our dashboard and check the order right here if it uh, exists or not and here is so this is uh, uh, today as you can see and this is the time and yes i'm recording this video in 1 a.m <laughs> i barely sleep like for four or five hours i have a lot to do besides my youtube channel i have uh, two sao blogs and i have uh, two uh, shopify stores that i'm working on right now and the only time i have to make videos for you guys is uh, 1 a.m as you can see so let's just get back to our alibaba dropshipping center in here and we will do the fulfillments on it so let's just reload the page just to sync out the data and as you can see it says my orders one as you can see simply click on it and it will show you the order right here as you can see in my case it says the reception address is incomplete modify it then place the order again because on the uh, shipping information i just put it a random address in here let's just close this and as you can see this is where you can find all the orders that has been unfulfilled and if you do have a lot of them you can select them from here and click on batch order and make sure you do actually check the address for the shipping and make sure everything is correct then do the batch order because once you do that you cannot get back or get a refund or change the address then it's too late for that in my case as well if you do have uh, a customer that didn't submit the address correctly you can fix it contact them and fix it from here then after that make sure you do select the shipping from here as you can see it will show you the shipping for the products and by default it will go for the cheaper one as you can see it will cost nine dollars and it will take between 12 and 17 days and they have other options like this for example air charter express U express us it will take between five and nine days which is really good however it costs 16 dollars but as i said at the beginning of the video alibaba tend to have really cheap products compared to aliexpress so the margin will be really high if you can afford 16 dollars for nine days maximum shipping it's really good your customers will be happy and you can scale really faster with faster shipping right now because the days of 25 or 20 days shipping is over you either have a week or 10 days or 10 15 days maximum or just give up on the product because your competition will beat you with that let's just go for the first one which is the standard then click on order right here it will my case it says address is incomplete so i did modify the address to make it correct right now and let's just click on order and after that the order on dropshipping center on alibaba was placed correctly all you need to do is pay for the order and click on pay after that it will take you to the checkout page just like any supplier or any shopping website and select the the payment gateway that you need to use and there is a lot actually here paypal uh, apple pay google pay uh, western union even wire transfer so just use the one that's suitable for you and click on pay now and it will be paid for and the order should be shipped to your happy customer and you keep the margin and you'll be happy and the customer happy and me will be happy if you drop a like below i would really appreciate it so that's how you fulfill orders on alibaba dropship center and as i said if you have any questions or any requests make sure to drop them below in the comment or check out my instagram right here below me i do reply to each comment as well as messages on my instagram and if you are wondering why is that because simply i'm working for you otherwise i think my job is done for this video so thanks for watching catch you on the next one